He's so cute. Welcome to the vlog. It's uh, October 24th and today is going to be a special vlog. Um, it's going to be for um, mainly for Annalyn because her birthday is, is tomorrow. So um, she will be coming down the stairs here shortly and we will uh, continue the vlog. But for the, for the uh, meantime, watch, watch this guy. He's, he's watching a video on his iPad. Bud? How are you? Good. It's my boy right here. My big boy. So Daddy. the birthday girl is here and she is dressed up. What are you dressed like? A cat? A black cat. So she's dressed up as a black cat for, for dance, right? It is like a dance Halloween week. Anyways, so her birthday is tomorrow, but today, nine years ago, um, Jessica and I went to the hospital. Um, and what, what's funny is, the way the story is, is that um, we were actually in Phoenix. So we lived in Tucson at the time um, that we were pregnant with Annalyn and that's where we lived. And so Jessica and I lived there and our family lived up here in Phoenix. So we came up to Phoenix to spend time with them and it was over the weekend. And that's when um, Jessica realized that her water had ruptured. It didn't break all the way, but it was ruptured, which means, you know, that she, that her water was breaking. And so, we decided to drive home, drive back to Tucson instead of getting admitted to the hospital here in Phoenix because we didn't want to have to stay here. We wanted to, you know, kind of go through the with our birth plan that we had and, and see the, um, at that point, I think it was a midwife that we had um, in Tucson. So we went back to Tucson and right now it's about three o'clock here. And so three o'clock, nine years ago, me and mom were in the hospital and we were, like she started to get hooked up and I think we got to the hospital about two o'clock um, and that's when it became real that we were gonna have, um, we were gonna have our, our baby. And um, we just both got emotional because we knew that we were gonna have Annalyn today, or so we thought. And it took a long time, time? To, to have her. Um, she was born the next morning, um, about six something. Well, I was born six early. in the morning, um, the 25th. I'm an Here. early bird. Yeah. So that'd be cool. Today we're gonna go. We have like normal Wednesday stuff. We've got dance. We've got the gym. We've got some errands to run. And so I will continue the story um, as as the day as the vlog continues. So you look cute. I like it. Oh look, she has a tail too. It's a tail. Ow. Sorry. You popped my finger. Jeez. <laughs> oh, this boy right here. What's up? <laughs> hey guys, Annalyn's inside. Um, she's she's doing her solo right now. Jessica's watching her real quick, and then we're gonna head to uh, run some errands, and then we'll be at the gym. I'm here at the gym, and um, our class is at 5:30, and um, I've got like a few minutes, so I'm gonna just I'm gonna finish the vlog and kind of finish the story of Annalyn's birth, I guess her birth story. We're at the uh, we're at the hospital, and um, she is uh, taking a long time to be born, I guess. I, I don't know really what the term is. Um, anyways, she um, is. I think right now, right now it's like five o'clock. So Jessica was doing some walking and, and like on the, on the ball and that kind of thing. And it just, it was taking a really long time to, uh... hey, hey. hey, what's up, man? How are you? Good, good. See you in there. Yeah. You so it was just, it's taken a really long time for, um, for her to be born. And so what they ended up doing was giving her an epidural, like late at night, I think it was like eight or nine o'clock at night told her to go to sleep and to kind of rest. And I went to sleep on like a chair, Jessica slept on the, the bed, um, the hospital bed. And the next morning about like six o'clock or 5.30, six o'clock, the midwife came in. She, she checked Jessica and said that you're gonna have this baby in about an hour. She came back in about 45 minutes and then Annalyn was, was born. And um, yeah, so that's the rest of the story. Um, there's uh, actually there's there's something that a lot of people don't know um, when Annalyn was first born I mean she's healthy and everything um, but they found that she had a uh, uh, it's called a VSD it's a, like a hole in her heart 
And so at that point, Jessica and I were pretty, you know, we were scared. We didn't know what was going on. We didn't know um, how she would be and all of that kind of stuff, how she would grow up. And, you know, it's crazy. It's like nine years later, she's doing um, things that we didn't expect her to do. Um, she's competitively dancing and she's able to keep up with um, her peers and all of that kind of stuff, which is just so grateful and so thankful to God every single day for her. And so um, that's something that maybe you guys, some of you guys maybe um, who watch the vlogs don't know, you know about her.